Welcome. In this video, we shall discuss about Levi Kotsky and language development. My name is Dr. Kibet from the Center for Open Distance and E-Learning at Chakos University. What did Levi Kotsky say about how children develop language? Language is a social concept that is developed through social interactions. So according to Levi Kotsky, who was a 20th century Soviet psychologist, language acquisition involves not only a child's exposure to words, but also an independent process of growth between thought and language. By Kotsky's influential theory of the son of the son of proximal development, asserts that teachers should consider a child's prospective learning power uh, before trying to expand the child's grasp of language. Levi's Kosky theory of language development focused on social learning and the soul and the soul of pro proximal development, that is the CBD. And the CBD is a level of development obtained when children engage in social interaction with others. It is the distance between a child's potential to learn and the actual learning that takes place. Bykowski's theory also demonstrated that PHA underestimated the importance of social interactions in the child, in child development. Bykowski believed that children learn through social interactions with adults. He also believed that dialogue with others help a child in promoting cognitive development. Adults, teachers, and peers have a major impact on the child's development of mental, of mental processes. As children develop, they gradually internalize processes they use in social context and begin to use them independently. This internalization process allows children to transform ideas and processes to make them unique, uniquely their own. So according to Vykotsky, much important learning by the child occurs through social interactions with a skinful tutor. The tutor may be model, may model behaviors and or provide verbal instructions for the child. He believed that children use language to plan, to guide, and monitor their behavior. Children first use language to develop ideas socially, which are then internalized, and first children think out aloud, which slowly becomes internal private speech, which they use to organize thoughts. Children learn through social and cultural experiences. Interactions with peers and adults can help with this process. While interacting with other children, while interacting with others, children learn the customs, the beliefs, and the language of the culture. They can also perform more challenging tasks when assisted by a more advanced and competent person. Vygotsky theory of language is based on constructivist learning theory, which contends that children acquire language as a result of engaging in social experiences. Through social and language interaction, older and more experienced members of the community teach young children and less experienced members the skills, the values, and knowledge needed to be productive members of that community. So Vygotsky constructive language theory exists in opposition to Jean Biaget's theory of language acquisition. According to Biaget, children construct language or knowledge about language through a complex process of assimilation, stressing the inherent capability 
of a child's brain to adapt to stimulation. And finally, the language learning process occurs as a result of give and take. Parents and teachers usher a child through a process of guided discovery, addressing a learning potential, and eventually children internalize language skills. So in this video, we have been discussing about Lev Vygotsky and language development. If you like this video, kindly subscribe to receive notification of new uh, videos whenever they are posted. You can like or even share with your friend. Thank you.